hello everyone welcome to yorpedia global so in this video i'm going to discuss with you some few of the phd position with scholarship around the globe in different prestigious university which you people can apply if you are coming from electronics electrical signal processing control and automation integrated circuit and electronics devices domain so if you are doing your masters or you have completed your bachelor in this domain what i quoted earlier so these position are somewhere aligning with your future aspiration especially if you are looking forward to do your higher research from some top international university abroad so we can start with the first position it's with the swansea university uk in the school of aerospace civil electrical and mechanical engineering the research area is wireless power transfer system for medical implant device you know in recent time there are many advancement which have taken in the domain of wireless technology and it's being incorporated across the diverse domain or diverse area and diverse field so if you are willing to work in you know enhancement of your master thesis and if you believe they were somewhere in the preliminary area as per this research then you are suitable candidate for this position and yes the duration is 3.5 year it's not have any particular deadline it's a rolling position means once they find the suitable candidate they will close the position so that's what i told you people in the beginning whatever position i'm discussing here if you find any of them relevant and aligning with your future aspiration don't delay immediately visit the university website and explore in more detail about the research area and their prerequisite and requirement and see whether you are in position to apply or not and don't forget to at least share your profile attaching your cv with the potential supervisor who are supervising this project or this area right so you can see here yes it's a fully funded position and they have asked some prerequisite like qualification in electronics electrical engineering biomedical engineering or physics domain they have told strong background in electronics circuit power electronics and machine learning obvious if you want to work on the wireless domain or wireless technology you must have a very good hands on experience or real time experience on the power electronics devices and electronics devices proficiency in programming language such as python it's truly required everywhere in today's time a very renowned descriptive language c c++ and matlab demonstrated relevant project experience excellent analytic and problem solving skills so if you believe you have done some earlier project which can work as a interface to connect your profile to this requirement then it's an add on advantage right so next position we have it is basically from unsw sydney it's a experimental free space quantum communication duration is 3.5 year it's again the rolling position and it's fully funded 40000 per annum plus 10000 top up scholarship and they are asking that for international applicant from the non sanctioned countries may also be considered subject to approval applicant with strong interest in experimental quantum optics are encouraged to apply and two position are open to candidate who possess or hope to possess soon a first class degree in electrical engineering physics or closely related discipline applicant with well developed skill and verbal communication skill will be considered favorably be willing to provide your personal detail by way of a student deed poll right so that's what if you are interested to apply for this project you can also see on the university website who are the potential supervisor who will be supervising this project you can email them and share your profile or candidate with them then what is the structure of that email how you need to basically you know write that email that should contain very crisp and appropriate information and it must include your selling point it's like selling yourself to professor and asking for his approval like this if you're doing the process repetitively or iteratively for different phd position i am sure many professor will share consent for your profile and few of will also give you some tips how you can enhance or improve your academic profile that's what your pd global mentor keep on assisting you people always start mailing as much as professor you can do related to your domain then you can only maximize or optimize your chances selection third position is again in electrical engineering university of southampton to phd in materials and device for photonic coprocessors 
ड्यूरेशन इज 3.5 पॉइंट फाइव ईयर लास्ट डेड लाइन इज ट्वेंटी फर्स्ट ऑफ मार्च टू जीरो टू फोर एंड दे आर आस्किंग इट्स फुली फंडेड पोजिशन वी आर लुकिंग फॉर अ पैशनेट कैंडिडेट एक्साइटेड अबाउट द लेटेस्ट डेवलपमेंट इन टेक्नोलॉजी यू विल नीड अ बैकग्राउंड इन फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स और रिलेटेड डिसिप्लिन अ बेसिक अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ सेमी कंडक्टर फिजिक्स ऑप्टिक्स फोटोनिक्स एंड मेटीरियल साइंस आर एसेंशियल एक्सपीरियंस इन एक्सपेरिमेंटल फिजिक्स इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स ऑप्टिक्स और फोटोनिक्स एंड कंप्यूटेशनल मॉडिंग एंड प्रोग्रामिंग विल बी एन एड ऑन एडवांटेज सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू अप्लाई फॉर दिस पोजिशन materials and devices for photonic coprocessor then if you are coming from the physics domain if you are coming from the electronics domain and you have done some good relevant courses as per the requirement of this research area as per the requirement of professor advertised with this position then you can make yourself a best fit for this position don't delay there is deadline that is 21st of march 2024 now the last position for today's session we have in aberdeen university scotland proposed area is dynamic voltage support of inverter based resources duration is 3.5 year again there is no specific deadline it's basically again if they find a suitable candidate they will close it if you believe you have already worked on this research area or somewhere in the periphery or aligning or interdisciplinary area of this research area you can apply for this position right it's a fully funded position they are asking a solid background with evidences in the power system and power electronics and experience in dynamic simulation tools like matlab simulink pscad etc is essential experience in hardware in the loop experiment is preferred so these are the prerequisite they are asking for so guys these are the some of the phd position i come across throughout these number of days definitely i will be coming up with more phd positions and similarly other people are sharing for civil engineering few are sharing for the environmental few mentors will be sharing for the computer science few will be sharing for the mechanical additive manufacturing etc so if you believe any of the position is aligning with your future aspiration you can connect us you can uh, you know comment there down in the section our executive will shortly connect with you they will ask for your personal detail else you can visit our website europedia global there every information is mentioned you can book your one on one free session with the mentors from there every week a day one day in each week we have planned some free guidance session one session for ms student and one session for the phd student you can come there and ask and clear your doubts with the mentor especially with those mentor who are sitting abroad right so i wish you all the best so if you are looking forward to apply for phd position abroad or ms abroad don't forget to subscribe the youtube channel of the yorkpedia global thanks a lot